At first glance, it looks like a regular tornado, but this is something a little different, a land spout. These rope-like tornadoes tend to look narrow and have a different way of forming than a supercell tornado. A conventional tornado forms from the top to the bottom, extending from a rotating updraft. A landspout tornado actually forms from the bottom up, starting with the spinning motion at the ground. An example is in the western plains when cool air rushes off the Rocky Mountains and collides with the hot, dry air of the plains. Landspouts usually last for about 5 or 10 minutes, doing minimal damage. While these kinds of tornadoes tend to be weaker and shorter lived, they're also more unpredictable. There isn't a visual indicator from the ground, like a wall cloud preceding a supercell tornado. Because they form from small scale boundaries, it's harder for weather models and observations to pick up on the signs. Some landspout tornadoes have packed winds up to EF2 strength, so take them just as seriously as supercell tornadoes. For Weather Nation, I'm meteorologist Steve Glazier.